Hello, I'm Lori Vick with University Hospitals and welcome to The Health Difference. When Jim Beak joined a clinical trial as a healthy participant, he had no idea his volunteerism would end up saving his life. But it surely did, thanks to the experts at UH's Neurological Institute. Retiree Jim Beak is an avid volunteer for organizations like Meals on Wheels and in the medical community. When he joined a clinical trial which involved brain imaging, he was shocked with what the scan revealed. They had found an item of interest in one of my scans, which was a four millimeter aneurysm. Jim came into the care of Dr. Warren Selman, director of UH's Neurological Institute. And an aneurysm is like a blister or a little balloon off the side of a blood vessel, and they do have a chance to rupture, which can be a life-threatening problem. Dr. Selman performed a minimally invasive endovascular procedure. We navigate the catheter, which is a little tiny tube, up to the brain blood vessels, and then put inside the aneurysm a coil, kind of like a slinky, that fills up the aneurysm so blood flow no longer enters it. The catheter go up through the blood vessel, right into where the aneurysm is located here, and that's exactly what we did for you. Mr. Beak is perfect now. The aneurysm is sealed off. He never knew he even had the procedure, and he's out of the hospital and returned to his normal life. And back to volunteering. You know, volunteering can have some unforeseen advantages because in my case, I would not be here if they hadn't found this aneurysm. I'm thankful to Dr. Selman and his staff who were able to follow this aneurysm and uh, react at exactly the right time to uh, save my life at, at the uh, critical moment. For more information or to get a doctor referral, call 866-UH4-CARE anytime, night or day. Because at University Hospitals, our doctors make the difference.